What's up guys, thanks for stopping by today. We're gonna be doing an unboxing video, but first I'd like to send a very special thanks to everyone at Watch Me Grip for sponsoring this video. Grip has their all-in-one wireless chargers. This one has a 10 watt uh, QI sensor built in, so as soon as you place your phone over here on the holster, it'll begin charging it, uh, which is compatible with most devices. Uh, it also comes with its own little attachments, so you can mount it. Also, aside from the charging mount, they also have the universal mount. This one uh, also comes with the same attachments as the charging one. And lastly, they also offer a tablet mount. Now this tablet mount can accommodate a tablet from a, uh, four and a quarter inches all the way to 13 inches wide. And it also comes with a windshield and a dashboard mount. Uh, two very special uh, mounting hardware is the headrest and the cup holder mount, which I thought the cup holder mount was pretty cool. So anyways, we're gonna get to unboxing this one, uh, the wireless charger. If you guys wanna look at some of these products, you can head over to watchmegrip.com. They are partnered with Verizon Wireless, so if you guys wanna buy one of these, you can uh, head over to verizonwireless.com forward slash products forward slash grip. And also one last thing, Grip was also kind enough to send some few extra products. So we are giving away three of these standard mounts. So be sure to stick around to the very end of this video uh, for your chance to win one of these. All right guys, so we're gonna start by opening this box. This is the QI wireless charger. Real quick, it has a magnetic little flap right here, which is pretty cool. And here's the product itself. This is the AC clip. This is the actual attachment where the holster goes. Behind it, it has two little foam pads where it can rest the weight. And over here, this one is the one that grabs onto the vent clip. So you just pull it back, it has a little spring. Clip it onto the vent, release, and it'll rest right there. So we'll try this one. Also, this one right here is the CD slot uh, attachment. This one will just insert it right there in the CD slot. We'll just turn the butterfly and tighten it. We're also gonna try this one. This is the dash pad. This one I was reading up on it. So this one has a gel. This one has a gel pad right here, which is pretty sticky. And on the other side, it has a flat surface, so you can mount the actual telescoping uh, angled mount. And for simplicity's sake, a simple mount. This one has a sticky backing. You can place it anywhere on your vehicle. And of course, the actual telescoping mount. This one has an angled that pivots any angle that you want. Loosen up right here, you can extend it. And it also comes with a suction mount, which also has a gel uh, sticky back. So it ensures it won't fall off in the windshield. So we're gonna try that one also. And the mount. So this is GRIP's all-in-one wireless charger. So right here in the middle on the bottom is where the power supply goes in. It has two little chrome knobs on each side. So these are not, not buttons, but in fact these are touch sensors. Uh, you just touch them with your fingers and it'll open up these little arms. So we're gonna go ahead and try it. We also have the power supply and the wire. Here is the lighter plug, the USB lighter plug, and the three foot cord. This one comes with a type C. Okay, so I'm gonna start by testing out all the mounts and then we'll continue with uh, connecting the actual charger. Uh, so first I'm gonna try out the radio mount. This one goes in the CD slot. So this is an 07 Tahoe, so the CD slot is right here. We'll just put it in. 
and just tighten the butterfly just a few times a few turns so it feels snug and on the grip holster this plastic nut it just says to just loosen it and then we'll just clip it into place once you find the location that you wanted you can tighten up the nut from over here the plastic nut and that's it so that is the mount it's actually pretty good it's firm and I still haven't even tightened the back um, but it is pretty firm the only thing is it's in way of all the buttons of the radio so maybe this mount is not the best one for here uh, the the power and volume button is right underneath there's still a lot of space behind it and I could access it no problem but it's still covering some of the display right here so we're gonna go ahead and continue with another attachment see how it goes but it's very sturdy nonetheless very sturdy some other CD players might have a better space for it uh, right now I'm just gonna continue just testing out the other products and I'll find which one I like best the second clip is the AC vent clip. Uh, this one I would try it right here in the middle, but my plastic right here is a bit broken. Um, so over here, I'm going to try it over here, see how it fits. All right, so here's the vent. Just insert that one in there and release. All right, guys, so there is the second clip. This is the AC vent clip. Um, it has foam pads right here underneath and the cell phone goes right there it's still not tightened alright so now we're gonna try the suction mount this one has a screw right here you can loosen it up and you can set it at whatever angle you want it also has another screw right here loosen it up and you can extend it and of course the suction mount this one we're gonna take off the plastic this one right here in the bottom, the actual pad, is a gel pad. It's very sticky. Uh, not sticky, like adhesive sticky, but it's it's a gel pad. So we're gonna try it out on the on, uh, windshield. We're just gonna set this one right here. Hit the clamp. So there's that mount. All right, so this is the grip all-in-one wireless charger mounted on the suction cup mount on the windshield. This is the 07 Tahoe, and I think it looks good. One more attachment that I haven't tried, of course, is the simple one. This one just has a sticky back, and it has a mounting pad right here on front. So this one you can stick onto anywhere on your car. Uh, if you guys don't know, on my Mitsubishi, I have a pad right here, uh, a mounting spot for my phone, which I think is just a great spot to place your phone away from the radio, any controls or AC vents, and away from the windshield, which, you know, in case it interferes with anything, uh, viewing outside, this is the spot. I want you guys to look at the Mitsubishi. Over here in my Mitsubishi, I have the Night Eye Steely Ball and on the back of the phone it has the magnetic part so I just put the phone right there and just where I like it close to the center console close to the radio uh, the charging ports right there or the auxiliary is right there the only thing is that this one you know once you point it towards you um, it will just find its, itself pointing back so never holds its place there all right so that looks really good right there uh, sometimes simple is just better this one has a sticky back attachment and I just put the grip holster right here in front uh, I think it looks good right there away from the radio any control knobs this one uses a type C power supply. Goes in the bottom. There. I connect the lighter and the USB. All 
Nice. All right, so these chrome little dots right here in the side are not buttons. These are actually just a touch sensor. We'll touch it. And it also has another one on this side. Whichever one you push, it'll work. Here is my Samsung S10 Plus. Uh, this one has a bit of overspray right there in the screen. Thank you, Joe. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and put it right here. And just like that, it begins charging, fast charging. To open up the arms, as I said, right here in the sides, it has the chrome little dot. So you just touch it, and it'll open it up. Touch it once again, and it'll close. One more thing, this cell phone has the auxiliary or the headphone jack right here in this corner, which as you can see, it doesn't really affect it at all. Uh, that's one of the other wires that I always carry with me the auxiliary port uh, so I can connect it onto the um, auxiliary for the Pandora or anything like that so this one fits right in adjust your phone and it fits right here in the bottom there it is overall I like the holster it's one of those things that just makes your life just a little bit easier just walk in your vehicle, place your phone, it'll begin charging. If your radio does have a Bluetooth, it's even better. You don't need these, this auxiliary wire if you're listening to Pandora. If you guys want to learn more about these holsters, the grip all-in-ones, uh, go check them out at watchmegrip.com. And as I said, they are partnered with Verizon Wireless. You can find them in their product section. And of course, I will provide the links right here in the description so you guys can go check them out. Alright guys, so thanks once again to Watch Me Grip. We're going to give away three of these standard cell phone mounts. So all you have to do to enter to win one of these is just like this video, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, and leave me a comment saying that you're subbed, uh, saying that you're already subscribed. Even if you're already subscribed, leave me a comment just to let me know that you want to win one of these. Uh, second winner that I'm going to choose is through my Instagram. So I'm going to leave my link in the description. Head over there. I'm going to post a picture of the standard mount and all you have to do is just follow the instructions there and there's your second chance to win one of these the third person i'm gonna announce i'm gonna hand select this one the third person so good luck to everyone so that's gonna be it guys the winner i'm gonna announce them on friday this friday august the second so good luck to everyone and i'll see you then i'll keep reminding you every video i come up with from now till then i'll remind you of the giveaway make sure you guys are entered and uh, that's going to be it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.